Hello, I am back for another video. I got three packages here. One of these is from Rider Wear. I have ordered from them before and I did like their leggings, so I'm hoping I do like these. Another one was from a brand called Girls Who Lift. I've been seeing like their, it's like a crop top sports bra in one. Oh, by the way, if you think there's patches of blonde in my hair, there is. I was kind of running out of dye and I was like, fuck it, and I did miss some little patches so just ignore that please and then alpha elite which i have ordered from them before during their black friday sale but i didn't order any revival leggings this package got to me like two days from within me ordering it i've been waiting for these leggings to restock and they don't really announce when they restock stuff so i had to end up like checking up on the website and i did see you know if you comment on their instagram pictures Sometimes they'll respond to you and I did see Someone ask when are you gonna restock the revival leggings in Jade say Jade green whatever the color is and they replied they said in April So I ended up just checking like back every couple days and I was like right there when they restocked Well, I guess because it wasn't like a major restock or a major launch They ended up getting my order shipped to me literally like the day I ordered it two days later I got it so I've been waiting patiently to open this because I wanted to film it and I was waiting for everything else to get here So just shout out for Alpha Leaf for having super fast shipping. That was like really impressive So I think I'm gonna start by opening these Just because I'm the most excited for them Okay, so I do love how Alpha Elite's leggings, they come in like these really sterile looking packages. So you know it's never been opened before. You have to like kind of, I thought it was perforated, but I guess not. And I did get a size small, so I hope these fit. They don't really have like a size chart. They just had like it compared to US sizes. And I think I'm a size four, I think, from what I Googled. So we'll see if these fit. And um, so these, I think they look like they're gonna fit. Right off the bat, they're they're pretty soft. They feel like they're gonna be compressive, super stretchy. Love, love the color. I've been obsessed with green lately. Ever since my hair has been dark, I just love this like sage green. I'm a fan of the branding. It's really small. It's not all up in your face. Minimal branding is like my favorite. So these, I can already tell I'm gonna like them, honestly. They're super cute. They have like small details. I don't know if you can see, but it's like ribbed right here. And that kind of carries on in the front and it kind of creates like a contour which I think would give you like an illusion of like wider hips, like more of an hourglass figure. But we'll see once they're on. And then it continues kind of at the bottom of the legging, which I do like. It's really minimal. Um, it's simple, which I love. So I already tell I'm gonna like these. I'm gonna try these on, but I wanna try it on with something new that I bought. Now this one took longer. Um, I ordered this before I ordered those Revival leggings and they got here after. I think it took a little bit over a week for me to get them. Something like seven, nine business days, something like that, like a week and a half. You get a free little sticker, cute. It does come with um, those removable pads, which I like because sometimes I do take them off. And I like, mainly I got it because I like the length of it. I'm, I'm not one to really wear just sport bras alone at the gym. I need something a little bit more modest. So I like how long it is, basically. Like, I don't like showing a lot of skin between where my shirt ends and my leggings start. So I get everything high-waisted and I try to wear shirts that aren't too short. Like, yeah. And it has a nice minimal logo. It says, Girls Who Lift which I think is cute. And so I just got it in black. I would have ordered more colors, but I wasn't sure if I was gonna like it, you know? I'm gonna try these on real quick. Okay, so here is the shirt on the back, plain crisscross with the little branding bottom here. So far I do like the top like a lot. It's not like crazy cleavage, but it does make the boots look pretty good. 
and I like how it shows off the shoulders. I've been getting a lot of long sleeve tops, so I needed some like ones that are good for the Houston heat. Even though they do have a front seam, I don't feel like I'm getting major camel toe. Most of my seamless leggings give me that Barbie crotch or whatever, but I don't mind that at all. They do bunch up a little bit at the bottom, and that's just because I'm five feet four. I'm not very tall. I feel like they make the butt look good. These leggings feel comfortable, they feel soft, but they're also compressive. Not too compressive to where you feel restricted in your movements or your range of motion, but enough to like control if you're feeling bloated like today I am. Yeah, literally these leggings, I would love to purchase in more colors. I love these so much. Moving on, this is a bigger order, a right away. These are new, so I don't know. I feel like they changed them a little bit, but the old ones I love. I personally like them a little bit better than the Gymshark Bio Seamless, but a lot of people were comparing, I guess, the color range that they came out with to the Gymshark ones, but whatever. Um, we'll just see. We'll see. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Okay. So they're coming out with new neons, I guess. Neon 15, guys, if you want 15% off. I personally am not into neon at all, so I will not be purchasing that. But if you guys want to use that, I doubt that's like a one-time use code, so feel free to use that. I'm so excited. So I got two leggings and then one sports bra, because I need more sports bras in my life. So. Oh, no. Please don't be green. They come in similar packaging as Gymshark. They're not like individually like sealed off like Alpha Leaf. Like it's more, you know. You know. Are these small? These don't look small. And the thing about Rider Wear is you do have to pay to return stuff to them, which is not fun because they are not a US brand. So. They're in Australia, so cool. Which I didn't pay customs for this, which is nice. I did pay customs for the Vital Seamless, which I ended up returning. Um, these feel a little bit thinner than their old ones. It could just be the color. I am wearing black seamless underwear, so they'll really be put to the test. Okay. And then purple. Now these don't look sheer at all. And these do feel they feel thinner than the old ones do. Which the old ones are a little bit thick, so I feel like people will like that. Especially for the summer, so it's hot. These look so big, but they are small. The waistband, I don't know if you can see, but it's ribbed. I'm like acting like you guys have seen these before. Not a lot of people do reviews on right away, and the ones I have seen aren't good, which is weird because I love them. Um, so they have a little heart booty design. These are like little squares. Um, it's not really pressed on, it's like different fabric, so it's like the fabric came like that. I don't know how to explain it. It's definitely not going to peel off or anything like that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to explain that. And then they do have their little Rider Wear logo, which looks a little bit like the Trending Now YouTube logo. And that is um, pressed on. And they have a similar concept to these leggings, like the way they do with the rib, with the squares. And it comes down to create that hourglass figure and then it comes down on the legging and then down here not sure if you can see but it is like a mesh it's only at the bottom though so these blue ones are the exact same and these do look more mint they're not green at all well actually they look a little bit blue green but they're not like a bright green like the other Gymshark ones were I like this color a lot better personally a lot more blue-ish 
yeah these aren't lavender they're like in between a purple and a lavender they're not so pastel Ooh, i've never got bras from them or any tops but i've been eyeing these so it has a little zipper a little promiscuous i did get black as well because it goes with everything and i mean i was eyeing the nude one too but i was like you know i don't know if i'm gonna like it so let me just get one and this already looks nice it feels thick feels supportive so if you have big boobies this seems like it would be right for you and it just says rider wear right here and it's like silicone you know rw on the bottom so it's really subtle which i love and then it has a little I cut my finger, that's what that is. It has like a little, what do you call that? I don't know what you call that, but you know, like a little keychain, <laughs> not keychain. You know, you know, you know what that's called. So I'm gonna try these on with the blue ones first. You could be promiscuous if you want. I <laughs> don't want to be. No, realistically, I'd probably keep it around like maybe right here. Right. Probably just to be safe right here. Love the top. Feels good. It feels super supportive. Like they're not moving. The girls are like, no, we're staying put. Oh, it does have pads in it. And I don't see a place where you can take them out, but they're not flopping around. Like I just barely noticed that they had them in there. And I actually like actually like it it gives it structure and i just realized i was gonna try the green ones first or the blue ones first but these are so 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 comfortable i remembered as soon as i tried them on i remembered why i love these and as far as them being squat proof it's about like 90 percent 95 percent i can see a little bit of where my underwear is but remember they're black so that could be why they're so stretchy there is like a little bit of extra fabric here, but it's not like so crazy. Booty looks amazing. But yeah, they have that little contour, which I do like. And these don't bunch up at all. I mean, like, them. Oh, that could be why they're bunching up. I didn't have them pulled all the way down. But these fit perfectly on my ankles. Again, I'm 5'4", so they don't bunch up, which but that doesn't bother me anyway. I love this. It looks super cute. Something different. I don't have any purple leggings. Wow. Seeing them on me is so different because my skin's brown, so I think I really like the way the color complements that. I'm just gonna keep the camera down here and then switch to the blue ones. Real quick, I just wanted to compare the colors so you guys can see the difference. Just so you see. They're a little bit bright, but they don't hurt your eyes or anything. They're not like neon. So soft. Literally so soft. Drum roll, preach. But, um, they are a little bit sheer. I like the color a lot. Riderwear does have a lot of sales, so, so feel free to wait for sales and then shop. I think there is some stuff on clearance right now, which I do like. I don't know what else to say. I hope this review was a little bit better than my last one. And not sure when I will be posting again, but feel free to subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed it or if I helped you with sizing or color or if you see something that you know you're gonna buy. See you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching and that is it. 